The White Marsh Mall curfew controversy continues. Management says it has no plans to enact a curfew for unaccompanied teens, despite the urging of the Baltimore County Council. WJZ is live. Tracy Leong with what this means for shoppers. Tracy. Well, Rick and Mary, this youth curfew is not binding, so it's up to the mall whether or not they want to enforce it. And so far, they've indicated they would not. On Monday night, the Baltimore County Council voted unanimously to pass a resolution urging the White Marsh Mall to put a youth curfew in place. People just don't feel as safe as they did at one time at White Marsh Mall after 5 o'clock. Co sponsored by council members Kathy Bevins, David Marks, and Todd Crandall, it's in response to an uptick in violence at the mall. Most recently, a massive brawl in August involving a large group of teenagers that ended with nine arrests, including two 19 year olds and seven juveniles for disorderly conduct. We don't want people to be afraid when they see 10, 15, 20. Um, Teenagers walking abreast where they can't get through. This curfew would require anyone under 18 to be accompanied by an adult over 21 Friday and Saturday evenings starting at 5 p.m. Several surrounding shopping malls have a similar policy, including the Towson Town Center, which is also owned by Brookfield Property Partners. I believe that has had a very positive effect on Towson Town Center. Not only do the customers feel safer, but also the employees. A policy some shoppers think will also boost business. I know they did it in Towson. And I know that it worked very well for them. It kind of has limited the amount of kids that are just running around without supervision, just kind of wreaking havoc. But not all patrons agree it's the best option. Probably make them angry and make them want to come and probably mess up the mob, make them more angrier. If you take away their privilege and they have right, they want to come to the mob, they should be able to come to the mob anytime they want. The White Marsh Mall does have a guidance age posted right on their website. It says anyone under age 18 should be accompanied by an adult, but it is not required. WJZ reached out to the mall management for a comment, but they did not respond. Reporting live, Tracy Leong for WJZ.